I'm Deborah Borchardt, and this is your Marijuana Money Minute. Green Market Report is hosting its first psychedelic investing conference on January 24th in New York City. Head over to www.greenmarketsummits.com to buy your tickets now. Markets were closed on Wednesday for the New Year holiday, but the dispensaries in Illinois were open. Illinois became the 11th state to legalize the sale of adult-use marijuana. GTI had four stores open for sales, while Cresco Labs had five stores open for business. Cresco said that it served 3,145 people on New Year's Day and sold 9,258 cannabis products with an average ticket price of $135. Harvest Health acquired M. Hardeen's Cheyenne property in Nevada in a deal valued at $35 million. Terrasen increased its private placement to $30 million from a previously planned $24 million. 1933 Industries reported first quarter revenues of $3.9 million. Now that was down 26% from its previous quarter, and they blame that to the decline in market share for vape and distillate sales in the recreational market in Nevada. C21 Investments delivered third quarter revenue of $10.58 million. That was a sequential increase of 7.5% over the second quarter and a big jump over last year's $305,000 for the same time period. The net loss for C21 was $5.1 million for the third quarter. And that's it for this week. Everyone, have a happy new year.